The 2021 Interschools Debate in BU was organized to build the skills of students in the art of public speaking, creative reasoning, and enhance knowledge of English grammar as well as general studies. Most importantly, the 10 public and private schools debate competition was dedicated to Member House of Representative Mokhtar Betra Aliu for his untiring efforts towards the development of his constituency in all facets of human endeavor. The competition, which lasted more than one week, began with the group and knockout stage, which saw the emergence of Government Girls Secondary School, BU, and Command Girls School, Miringa, as finalists. It was exciting having the two top girls' schools in the area slogging it out on the topic, Genesis of Corruption. Who is to blame? Is it the masses or the government? Gigi Bu debated on the motion, blaming masses for corruption, while Command Girls Miringa were against the motion with their lines of argument blaming government for corruption. The lead speakers for Gigi Bu was Hawa Hamidu, followed by two supporting co-debaters. You will all agree with me that the masses are the one that established examination variable center, whereby this candidate can sit down idly in the exam hall or sit down comfortably in their home to have their ninth grade during election. Most of the masses are not voting the candidate by their own decision. Only as when they see money. For example, here is the right person to vote with their good character. But if the person did not give them money, they are not going to elect him. Everyone looters, everyone looters and corrupt leaders are being supported by the masses. Inside of the masses to call to order for his misconduct. They, they usually turn around him. Everywhere the masses is keen to get immediate transvigation to make what they want. Next was the turn of Command Girls School, Miringa, with Mariam Zainab Mohammed firing the Saras to beat their opponent to the max. Nigerians themselves view their country as one of the world's most corrupt. As government officials see public offices as an opportunity to enrich their pockets and their people. It is common to, see, to hear government officials say words like, life not tone by tone, so wait for your own time. By extension, they mean this is the time for them to enjoy the offices they occupy and won't stop at anything to amass all the wealth they can within that period. Misappropriation of properties. Officials at all levels of government have the right, have the freedom to use the government properties for their personal needs with impunity. Corruption in security sector, media corruption, bureaucracy bottleneck, corruption in petroleum sector, trade-related corruption and judicial corruption. At the end of the debate, it was the turn of the panel of judges led by the director, Academic Planning College of Education Waka, Dr. Mercy Wakawa, to declare the results and announce winners. Command Girls Secondary School Miringa took the star prize as winners. Gigi Bu collected medals for second position and Government Senior Science Bu as third. We have Gigi SS Bu with 67.6 points, while Command Girls Secondary School Miringa have 79.6 points. Mukhtar Betra Aliu, in whose honor the debate competition was organized, had Bill Elder Alaji Hassan Kantoma as representative. I now appreciate that uh, the education standard has start rising again. And uh, this is something we are very proud of because uh, when you look at these little girls and boys speaking good English, why sometimes you need to look at the dictionary to understand what they are saying. Uh, we are really very proud of them. And uh, honestly, we pray God that uh, it will continue and then we will get its former name that we are leaders in this state in terms of education. After the thought-provoking presentation, the federal lawmaker's representative announced motivational gifts to all the participants from the 10 schools and the debate organizing committee. Mukhtar Betra Aliu gave all the three participants, each from the 10 schools, 50,000 Naira each and the organizing committee 1 million Naira. With the advent of my junior brother Tukur Buratai and the right honorable Mukhtar Betra Aliu, plus the current governor we have in Professor Zulum, you is now ready to move again. And uh, we are very grateful to these three 
We pray God to reward them abundantly. The story ended with everyone returning home smiling. <laughs>